So today we're going to do some gentle breathing that's going to focus on bringing our breath back into a coherent pattern. And what I'm talking about when we're talking about um, coherent breathing is that alignment between our emotional state, our mind and our hearts. Basically, it's when everything feels more in balance and it flows just as it should. So when we focus on our coherent breathing, it helps us to feel more in our flow. It helps us to activate the rest and relax state. It helps us to feel more connected to ourselves and connected to those around us. It can create a sense of calm in our body as well. It also helps to support us when we're shifting between different environments. So maybe shifting from your work into your home environment. It can help support a good night's sleep. And really importantly, it can help to quieten in the monkey mind or that constant chatter that we often feel. Our coherent breathing also helps create that sense of balance and harmony in the body and helps to reduce feelings of frustration, of anger, and also overwhelm. And what's really important is it actually allows us that greater connection with those around us and those that we're close to also, but can create a very um, harmon harmonious environment also in the workplace. So this is a little uh, breathing exercise that you can do at any time of the day, uh, first thing in the morning, middle of the day, before bed, or even when you wake up during the night as well. So I invite you now to find a comfortable space, either sitting on a chair or lying down on the floor. So making yourself very, very comfortable. Checking in and seeing, how do I feel in the body? Do any of my muscles feel tense or tight? Maybe your shoulders can come down from your ears a little bit. And just starting to bring your attention and your focus to the breath. Taking a couple of nice long inhales and a nice long extended exhales with no effort whatsoever. So breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in again. And breathing out. And taking one more breath in. And a nice long exhale. And now I'd like you to bring your focus or your attention into the area of the heart or that center of the chest. And you may find this easier to do by closing off the eyes. Continuing to breathe and just imagine that your breath is flowing in and out through the heart or the chest area. Maybe breathing a little bit slower and breathing a little bit deeper than usual. Noticing how the breath feels as you bring all your awareness to it. And just checking in to see how you feel today. Again, slowing down the breath, allowing it to enter the body with a nice long inhale. And a gentle, effortless exhale. And seeing how you feel as you focus on this. And now I'd like to bring into your, into your mind now a memory. So a memory of something that's happened throughout your life. And it can be of a person, of a special place or a holiday, or it can just be something. 
But what we want is we want this memory to evoke a feeling, an uplifting feeling of gratitude, of joy, of love, of compassion, or just of harmony. It might just be a memory that makes you smile and activates that uplifting feeling in the body. And what I'd like you to do now is to focus on that memory while breathing in deeply and slowly in and out of the body. So continuing to focus on whatever this memory is for you. And the most important thing is that it evokes uplifting feelings. Again, gratitude, joy, compassion, or love. And all the while, while your focus is on this memory, you're continuing to breathe deeply in and out through the heart area. And noticing how this feels in the body. And if your mind feels really busy today and there's thoughts whizzing in and whizzing out, that's okay as well. If you're struggling to hold that one memory in your focus, that's okay as well. You can allow that memory to pass and maybe allow another one to come in in its place. The important thing is that the memory that's currently there allows you to feel in the body the uplifting feeling or emotion. And as you continue to breathe in and out through the heart area and breathing into this memory, notice how it feels in the body. Becoming aware of any physical sensations that arise. What do these sensations feel like? Can you notice where you feel the sensations in your physical body? And not becoming part of them, but just observing them from a little distance. Just noticing them. Acknowledging the sensations and just observing them. And all the while is keeping the awareness and the focus on whatever that memory is for you. Continuing to breathe, nice, long, slow inhale. And a gentle, effortless exhale in and out through the heart area. If it helps, you can place your hand on the heart area to bring awareness to breathing into that area. Not forcing it, but just making process as effortless as possible. And by focusing on our heart and bringing the awareness to our breath, it allows us to slow down our minds and our emotions. 
It allows us to make much better decisions. And very importantly, it allows us to respond to different situations rather than reacting. It allows us to see things more clearly. And these heart-based qualities that include appreciation, care, compassion, kindness. These are emotions that renew and uplift us instead of depleting us. So again, bringing awareness to whatever that uplifting memory is for you. And breathing deeply through the heart area into that memory. And we can practice this technique at any time of the day. First thing in the morning, during the day at any time when you need a little bit of extra help, before bedtime, or you can even practice it if you wake during the night and can't get back to sleep. So even five to 10 minutes a day of this technique can have a really beneficial impact on your mental, your emotional, and your physical well-being also. So if you have the time today, continue to breathe for a few more minutes and just notice how you feel after you finish. So thank you for joining me today and I'll see you all very soon.